Hey YouTube, what is going on? It's Tiger here today guys and uh, in today's video I have something a little special for you guys kind of a uh, test video kind of uh, experiment here and uh, yeah there's gonna be a rare car video coming up for you guys too because uh, I just realized uh, yesterday actually or the day before that uh, the dune loader which is this bad boy right here is one of the rarest cars in GTA 5 online actually you cannot buy this thing from Super San Andreas or San Andreas Super Autos I think it's called believe it or not you can't buy this thing anywhere it can only be found so I'm gonna be I'm gonna have a uh, spawn location coming out for you guys pretty soon for the uh, dune loader um, but yeah this thing's pretty badass and uh, I'm gonna sh today's video guys is all about um, snorkels and whether or not they actually work because uh, now that they added the uh, new squatty into the game which is the uh, Hummer H1 I wanted to uh, test out a whole bunch of vehicles and their snorkels to see which ones actually work like they're supposed to and uh, believe it or not the dune loaders works just as it should and uh, yeah you cannot drown this thing as long as the snorkel is above water this thing can go wherever you want it to go as long as you don't uh, get stuck on rocks like that <laughs> but yeah you can go into pr some pretty deep water with this thing like up here it's, it gets quite a bit deeper actually this is my favorite mudding spot in the whole map actually it's pretty pretty sweet but yeah look at look at how deep we are right here it's absolutely fine oh we're sinking a bit oh god oh no tide's coming up even though we're in like a pond but the water's rising a bit there it's getting a bit sketchy oh it's going down now what's going on it's like waves in here or something it's pretty crazy i don't know how that guy got his boat in here i'd like to know that that's pretty interesting but yeah he's having a blast over there but yeah as you can see we're still a-okay here in the squatty we're almost floating but this thing the engine's still going strong because of that snorkel which is functional which is sick the only thing that really sucks is uh, the uh, Meriwether Mesa, I believe it is, or the Mesa. It's like the off-road suit. It's like the upgraded uh, Jeep. It's got like the roll cage on it and uh, the nice big off-road tires. It's like lifted. The snorkel on that thing doesn't even work. And like, basically, the the way you know if a snorkel is gonna work now in GTA 5 is if the if the vehicle that has the snorkel comes equipped with that, like, before any modifications, that's basically how you know, what, oh, I'm finished now. Oh, yeah, see, there you go. So, as, as long as the snorkel's above water, you're good, but I just destroyed it there. But yeah, anyway, so, like, the Mesa, the uh, the snorkel, like, comes on it from Meriwether. Like, if they drive the Jeep up to you and the, the one spawns or they, they come up in the one that has the snorkel, like, I would figure that it would work because it's already equipped on the Jeep, but it actually doesn't which really sucks. All right guys, so now we are in the brand spanking new Mammoth Squatty. I believe it's made by Mammoth, I think. Pretty sure. Nice classic Hummer H1. Too bad it's only like the pickup variant. I wish it was like the actual full Humvee, but it's like the enclosed like proper SUV or truck, whatever you want to call it with the turret on top. That would be pretty sweet, but yeah, as you can see, this thing is pretty badass, as long as you don't, the water doesn't go, oh my god, oh, can we make it, oh, we just barely made it, but yeah, you gotta really watch to make sure the uh, snorkel doesn't go under there, because if it does, oh my god, you'll, you'll, uh, you'll ruin it, of course, but it still can go pretty deep, though, like, this is a pretty, pretty insane river crossing here, like, as you can see, like, the water's all the way up to the hood, practically, oh, almost over the hood. I mean, uh, yeah, it's over the hood, it's almost like up to the roof practically, but, uh, yeah, this thing handles that with ease. It's pretty quick, too, like, it's got good four-wheel drive, obviously you'd expect that from an H1 Hummer, but it's pretty quick, too, like, it's not bad, I'd say it's one of the, definitely one of the best off-roading vehicles in the game, for sure, just due to the fact that it's, uh, has the snorkel, like, hardly any vehicles in this game have a snorkel, so, just because of the snorkel just makes it that much better, so... Yeah, it's it's pretty pretty sweet vehicle for sure. Oh crap! Whoa, we almost 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 drowned it there. It's all good though. Oh, we drowned it. Failure. Oh, we're floating a bit though. Oh my God, what? How are we still going? 
Holy crap, this thing is a tank. How did we survive that? Holy, that was pretty insane. I'm gonna do a little bit longer footage on the squad here just due to the fact that it's brand new. I want to see how its hill climbing ability is. Let's take a gander here. Oh, no problem at all on that hill. Hey, you guys are probably wondering why there's a giant quarry uh, dump truck there and a garbage truck, but you guys are gonna see that in a moment. This is gonna be a longer video too, just a heads up guys, so you guys don't want to waste your lives watching this and uh yeah i don't know i guess you can just like leave the video but it's not going to be too too insanely long but uh will be a longer one just a little heads up for you guys let's see if we can make it up this this valley here holy crap this thing is insane man holy holy that was actually pretty unbelievable holy crap i don't think anything else would have been able to do that wow can we uh but this this thing isn't even fully upgraded either. This is just creator mode, guys. So like, holy! Once you fully upgrade this thing, you probably go up any hill. Oh oh, this one's slightly too tall for it. But yeah, that's that's insane though. I don't think I've been able to get anything else up that. Let's see, what was I going up before? Oh yeah, I was going up this little spot here. Let's see if let's see if it'll make it up here. This one's really challenging because there's like a sort of a ridge right there that kind of pushes you up and then front wheels don't get any traction and just oh 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 my god this thing is an absolute beast oh not quite oh we we're almost there though a little bit momentum and we'll make that let's see if you can try again that was so close holy crap this thing is an absolute beast okay come on power Come on, oh, oh, so close. You gotta be kidding me, man. How are we not making that? Okay, we gotta give it the beans here. Let's just send it. Send it! Ah, oh, see what I mean? Like, this stupid ridge here just screws everything up. Like, what the hell, man? It's ridiculous. Alright, well, I don't think we're gonna make that anytime soon, so... I'm just gonna get, show you guys the next vehicle here that has a working snorkel. These are like literally the only three vehicles in the game that have, well actually, like ones that you would buy anyway. But this is the uh, half track, the Bravado half track. And uh, this thing's pretty badass. You got a massive cannon on the back and obviously, hence the name, it's got uh, tracks just like a tank in the back, which is pretty sweet. It sounds a lot different than the, uh, what's its face, the, um, the dune loader. It's got like a oh I thought we I thought we swamped it there, but uh, yeah it's got like a different engine noise. It sounds a lot more beefy this one, but honestly I think I would take the Dune Loader over this just simply due to the fact the Dune Loader's free. I don't even know how much this is. I'm assuming like a couple million or a million at least, million and a half maybe. But uh, yeah it's cool to know that I think they actually patched this as well. I think that the uh, snorkel didn't work before on this. But I think that they, they patched it so it does work now. But uh, yeah, this thing is, is uh, like it's definitely, oh, and it, it dies like instantly. Like it, the second, like the snorkel gets covered in water there. So uh, I don't know, the Doom Loader seemed to do a bit better. And definitely the uh, Squatty is the king right now with, uh, like we were just flying through the water over there. We're like a boat. It's pretty insane. But yeah, let's get to our next one. All right, guys. So who would have thought that the... Uh, after the boys are p done picking up the garbage, they come out and do some off-roading in their little pricks dump truck. <laughs> it's hilarious. But uh, yeah, I don't know if you guys can see that there. There's the uh, snorkel at the back of the cab there. It's kind of like an air intake, I guess. Um, pretty sure that's what that is anyway. Obviously, this thing sucks at uh, off-roading. Like, as you can see, I'm stuck now. Like, you gotta be kidding me. Every time I start filming, I screw it up. And then I just get stuck, like, what the hell, man? But, uh, yeah, this thing is actually pretty badass. You can go pretty deep with this. So, uh, who would have thought that the butt lover's, uh, garbage truck here would, <laughs> would be so good. But, yeah, let's get this thing. All right, guys, so we have to call in the cavalry, And, uh, we're gonna get butt lovers unstuck. Those little pricks, they just don't know how to drive, man. So, uh... Yeah, we're gonna get some serious firepower here and get this thing out of here, hopefully. Maybe not. Maybe we're gonna get this massive, insanely huge... Oh. Oh my god. Oh. Holy crap, this isn't going as planned. 
Is this thing only two-wheel drive? Come on now. No, it looks like the, all the wheels are spinning somewhat. I'm just dominating that truck right now. Holy. Okay, there we go. Alright, hopefully we're on lodge now. Put some serious damage into the dump truck there. Wow, we just squashed the back of it. Holy. Oh, we wrecked it? Are you kidding me? I can't get in. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Well, that's just a major disappointment. What the hell, man? You got What? It didn't even respawn, though. So, like, what's, what's the story? <laughs> what the hell was that? The guy just paralyzed himself. Just broke his neck right there. Like, I don't know what that was, but... Okay, well, maybe we have to... Give it a little more effort here and get... Get the, uh, little pricks completely out of the water. Let's see how this goes. I don't know what the hell is why I can't get in it. I can get in this monstrosity perfectly fine. Oh my god. Okay, well that didn't really work either. Jeez, this thing is just just a beast. The amount of torque in this thing is ridiculous. Alright, there we go. I should be able to hopefully get in now. I would hope anyway. But yeah. Oh, is it gonna oh okay there we go. Come on, two wheel drive. You got like 10 tons of gravel in the back there. For extra traction, there we go. Perfect. Alright. Alright, little pricks, let's go. Hey, it's not broken after all. Alright, let's let's uh, commence the demonstrations once again here. Yeah, so this is about where the... Uh, What's its face? The squatty was kind of starting to float, and we're actually floating right now. We're pretty much a boat right now. Oh, oh my god, the snorkel is almost under there. But yeah, as you can see, this thing is pretty incredible. Actually, you know what? It kind of glitches out. Same with the phantom. Are you kidding me? We get stuck on everything with this. This is why you, this is why you don't really want to take a garbage truck off-roading, guys. But, um, I don't know. If, you're, if it's your last resort, like, you can... It's pretty much a barge, like, at this point. Um, oh god, but yeah, as you as you'll see here, for some reason, Rockstar they act as if the exhaust pipes are the snorkels because as long as the exhaust pipe is exposed, oh, actually the snorkel's somewhat exposed right now. Oh. As long as the exhaust pipe is exposed, um, you're good, like you're Gucci, like there's nothing happening. But the second the like. Yeah, the snor yeah, the snorkel's completely under right now. Like we're we're fully submerged at this point. We're a submarine basically. We're a trash submarine at this point. But uh oh, yeah, see the second wait, what? Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, we swamped it. Yeah, the second wow, what why am I getting injured from that? <laughs> He's holding his breath. Oh yeah, I guess he was holding his breath. I almost died there, I guess. Well, but, uh, well, yeah, what the hell was I saying? Oh, yeah, any- Oh, yeah, I responded. Responded? Well, I cannot- I can't speak. I cannot use words anymore, apparently, but, uh... Yeah, what was I saying? Yeah, the, uh, the smokestacks, they almost act like intakes for some reason. It's so strange, like, as long as the smokestack is out of the water, it, uh, it works. It's just so weird, I don't get it, but, um... Yeah, it does have a snorkel on it. What the hell? Get the hell out of here, buddy. I don't have time for you. But, um, <laughs> I missed every shot there, but... Another fucking yeah, like, it does have a snorkel, so I figured that, uh, that's another reason why I can go as deep as it can. But, uh, yeah, let's get to the next vehicle. Would you just leave me alone, buddy? Like, what the hell is your problem here? That's right, that's what I thought. Little prick. Alright, let's get in the truck. Alrighty, boys, so we're back. And, uh... What the hell is the name of this thing, anyway? Isn't it the... Oh, yeah, it's the Phantom, I believe. Yeah, it's the Phantom of the Opera, but, um... Oh, don't tell me we're about to get stuck again. Every time I start the video... Oh, no, we're Gucci now. We're good. Okay, but, uh, yeah, I'm gonna further prove the point that, uh... Exhaust stacks, or exhaust pipes, whatever you want to call them, on these big rigs basically act exactly the same as snorkels, which doesn't make any sense. But, yeah, let's fully sub... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. We're basically fully submerged right now, like I'm, I'm slowly suffocating in the cab, but uh, the truck's doing A-OK -okay and we're just flying along here underneath the water, like no problem at all. 
And yeah, like it just absolutely engines fully submerged, but the truck's like, you know what? I don't care because I've got my oh 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 oh. We screwed it up. Yeah, as soon as the stacks go underwater, then you're finished. But uh, as long as they stay above, you're fine. It's just so weird. Like you can fly along the water with this thing. It's so fast too for a truck. It's ridiculous. But uh, yeah, it's insane. All right, you guys guessed it. As you probably thought, the uh. The dump truck is your best bet when you want to do some serious deep water crossings, but uh, yeah, and uh, all jokes aside, I mean, it's probably not going to be your first choice, but uh, if there just happens to be one nearby, I mean, it's a pretty solid choice, I must say. It's not the quickest thing on the planet, but it's not the slowest either, and it can go through some pretty ridiculously deep water. And uh, yeah, kind of the same thing applies with this thing, as long as the smokestack is above the water, you're Gucci. Like, uh, so yeah, you're talking like at least some like 20 foot deep waters, I would think. Like, look at this thing. The, oh, I think we just hit a rock there. My bad. But, uh, yeah, you can, you can cross whatever the hell you want. You could even probably put like some cargo in the back of it if you wanted to. I'm sure you could get like a tank or something to stay back there or whatever tickles your fancy. But, uh, what is this even called anyway? Heavy dump industrial. That's funny, I took a heavy dump this morning. <laughs> Just kidding. Actually, no, I'm not kidding. Or am I? <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> yeah. This thing is pretty, it's pretty dope. How deep can we go anyway? Oh! Whoa, 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 we're floating. Oh, we're making it though. Where's that dude in the boat? I'm gonna go freak the hell out of him. Where is he? We're coming for you, buddy. Take a heavy dump right on ya. Whoa! Oh! Oh! Oh, we swamped it. Oh! Just... But the tip is just sticking out of the water just a little bit. How did, how did we swamp it? You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> what the hell is wrong with my guy? He's like paralyzed. It's just too much for him off-roading in this thing. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. That's pretty much all the vehicles in the game with snorkels. Functioning ones anyway that I know of. If you guys know of another vehicle that has a functioning snorkel, you guys gotta let me know in the comments so I can like edit this video and remake it because I'm just gonna be looking like a fool here if I don't have all of the vehicles with snorkels in the game. How- why do I have a gun? I thought I took the guns away. But yeah, anyway, I believe that's all of them. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and my little two second review of the squatty as well. And uh, if you guys did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe as always. And uh, see you guys in the next one. Peace.